Hey there guys, you're back with Marcus Making Things and today I'm going to show you guys how to restring and clean a acoustic guitar uh, top to bottom. This is my brother's acoustic guitar. It's an acoustic electric Ibanez. Um, just need the new set of strings and a little bit of cleanup. I don't know if you can see the dust build up here. Right up, all in there. Um, while I'm putting new strings on it and cleaning it, I'm also going to take a look and check out the electronic components, see if it just needs new batteries, uh, and see if it works. You can see that green light still going. So I'm gonna plug it in, see what's going on, and get this thing playing and looking brand new. Uh, a couple things that I picked up at the store while I was there. Uh, this is unrelated, that's for my guitar. I got these uh, Martin & Co. Authentic Acoustic uh, Medium 13 acoustic guitar strings. Also always handy to have one of these tools. Uh, I picked this up just for the purpose of this video so I can tell you guys just how handy and cheap these things are. Uh, it costs about a buck at your local music store and they're a great thing to have when you're taking on and putting on strings. Um, for the longest time I was doing it by hand. It's a pain in the butt. We all know it is. Pick one up. It's a dollar. Save yourself the time awesome stuff. Also picked up some lemon oil. Always good to have. Um, in the last video I had with you guys, I was showing you using the uh, Murphy's wood soap oil. Again, with that video, it's just in a pinch. When we're doing an uh, actual legit cleanup for a guitar that's not mine, I want to use the right stuff. So we're using lemon oil, Proline lemon oil for fretboard and conditioner. Works with rosewood fretboards and whatever whatever other fretboards you're using so a good thing to have and I will also be using that on an electric guitar in the next video so make sure to check that out other things you'll need a set of pliers for when you want to trim those strings after you put them on also taking the old ones off a rag and an old card you have lying around to try to scrape off any buildup for this I used a gift card that I used up all the money. So with that, we're gonna enter hyperspeed, get the strings off, and I will then slow down and talk to you guys about how I go about cleaning. So with that, So now I wanted to take a second to show you guys the difference just from using a little bit of lemon oil and a rag. Uh, you can already see over here we haven't used it yet and over here we have. So those are like the dead finger DNA and dirt and gunk that we saw earlier. All that nastiness which affects the smoothness of your plane so it's good to get that off um, when I start to get to the lower frets or the middle frets rather it's where you see the most build up here don't really see it too much down here so what I'm gonna do over here is use the card which you guys can see in one of my other videos cleaning an electric guitar to kind of get most of this off so it looks more like down here and then I'll go back with the oil and a rag and polish that up. After that we put the strings back on. I fixed the electronics on this earlier and we already cleaned the body a little bit 
with just a rag and a very, 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 very small amount of water on the rag. Very wrung out. So, now we just finish up the neck, put the strings on, tune it, and we're ready to go.